All right, so we're gonna take a look at the legend today with the 1.14 update in. Uh, my test bed is kind of a mess. It's, well, the only grass that I have left. This is what I've been up to here. We extended the yard. Uh, if you remember, this was all bushes before and where the trailer is there, that's kind of where the yard ended. So between extending the yard and dealing with all the chicken stuff, it's it's been busy lately. But uh, I was excited to try this update. Shout out to Nokta. It was very easy to install their new update tool. It's you know, simple. You plug it in and it takes you step by step right through the process. So what I've been doing is I've been trying to mess with the deep target mode. And what I've come to realize is both, both of the enhancements, the deep target mode and the beast mode, is doing exactly what they say in the manual. So it was tough for me to find a difference on the deep target boost, which we'll look at first, because these targets are coming through to my machine. And that mode is really to pull something through that was previously masked, a, a non-ferrous that was previously masked. But I did find one, which is this uh, eight inch thimble here. So I'll show you that on, on a clean target, just in case you're testing this and you're like, hey, why isn't it working? Or I don't, I'm not hearing a difference. So I'll show you that at, level, at the levels uh, from zero up. So we're at recovery speed five. I'm using an iron filter of one, stability of five. Notice those settings work fine for me. Uh, out in the field, bottle cap zero, ground stability zero, deep target will start at zero. All right, so let's look at this. This is an eight inch buffalo nickel, All right, ID of 25. Let's go up to six. All right, ID fine, not hearing much of a difference there. Let's look at this now on a deeper target. With a zero, this is a 10 inch V nickel. All right, and let's bump it up to six. All right, so I'm not hearing a difference there. When I did though, is I went through and I noticed this eight inch thimble as I was checking. And let's go to DT zero here. It's, it's one way, it's choppy. And then I bumped up the DT to six, and I was getting a nice two-way hit. So that's the type of instance that I think that's gonna be beneficial right there is helping pull through the iron. So there's a look at the DT. Other than that from my test garden, I'm not getting a good, another good example to show because I think, like I said, it's doing just what they wanted it to do, and that's pull, um, non-ferrous when it's masked and right now there's none of these that wouldn't you know come through uh, by themselves so like an eight inch uh, six inch large scent here i'm not hearing any difference at all between them all right so let's take a look at the beast mode so the beast mode works in gold field you can see i have it in beast mode already now what I'm noticing about this in Goldfield, you're not gonna have the bottle cap reject or something to knock out large iron. But what the instructions do say is that it lowers the volume of the iron, um, which can be beneficial, but I would like it to break it up or chop it up something like it does not with a bottle cap reject, which we don't have. And, and I'll show you why for that. So let me go over to recovery speed and now in beast mode, we have the iron reject and that's it. So if we go over this iron sidestep here with a zero, very loud, mostly non-ferrous on the meter. All right, now we go into this and we add, we'll max it out. The volume goes down. So it's doing what the manual said, the volume goes down, but I'm not getting an indication of iron. And what I, what I mean by that is even if it's a non-ferrous target, so iron uh, rejection at zero over this eight inch buffalo nickel and max it to five, gets quieter just like it does on the iron. So I'm not sure, um, this to me would be, the beast mode would be like all metal hunting, right? D dig it all. Uh, I wouldn't go by the iron, I wouldn't go by the volume of the iron reject because it's doing the same thing on non-ferrous targets. 
it's just dropping the volume. Let's go step by step and see how much drop it has. So here's zero, one, two, three, four, five. So it looks like the pretty drastic drop, drop is between zero, one, and two. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, sound the same. Now let's go over to the nickel, zero, one, two, three, four, five. Let's try a high conductor. Let's look at the, uh, the large scent here Z at zero. One, two, three. So the drastic drop, drop is three here on this large scent. Four, five. So we're not getting any breakup like we do in say a park mode with bottle cap. So if, if you do use some type of rejection with the bottle cap reject, which all oh, the, the verses got it, the Manicor's got the lower limits, the Deus 2's got the bottle cap, the Equinox lineup has the Ferris as well, the FE settings. So if you go into here and you raise this up on the iron sidestep, you get a nice iron tone. Now you get a nice iron tone. It will create masking. See that? We're getting a lot of iron tone now on that buffalo nickel. Because there's iron in the ground. But even at a four, no problem rejecting that side step. Three, no problem rejecting that side step. Even two is given a great indication of iron and you still pull through, target's fine. So if you are someone who's sick of digging large iron, um, you have the bottle cap feature for that, but you don't have it in your boost mode at all. So boost mode is only, it has the iron filter that lowers the volume. That, that's all it does. So that's what it sounds like. And then we'll go up to five. All right, now this is a beta, so maybe they will put some type of um, filter in here because that's what it is, right? It's an iron reject, but right now what it's doing, it's lowering the volume on ferrous and non-ferrous. So it'd be nice if people want to use the beast mode, I keep calling it boost, but beast mode to have some type of rejection in there because it is deep, uh, that's for sure. It is This beast mode is a deep mode, but right now it has really no iron rejection to it for the the large iron and if that if you're looking to ignore that it's dropping the volume instead of chopping it up it seems to me all right everyone thanks for watching